Well, people in the nearby neighborhoods that they are shaken and confused after Olmstead County deputies chased a man with an outstanding warrant through their backyards and into the river. On the scene for us tonight is our Maisie Olson. Maisie, what are neighbors saying about this incident tonight? Yeah, Robin, the suspect is 47 year old Frankie Hansen. That police chase ended right here in River Park, which is located just behind a neighborhood here in Orinoco. Now, neighbors say that Hansen was running through their backyards, officers chasing him with their guns drawn before Hansen eventually jumped into the Zumbro River right here behind me. Olmstead County Sheriff Te Kevin Torgerson says Hansen violated his GPS monitoring, got a DWI, and violated a no contact order for domestic assault. Hansen never showed up for his court hearings. Just before 10 this morning, deputies were issuing that warrant when they say Hansen took off. Around 15 officers from the sheriff's office, the state patrol, and even a law enforcement helicopter were called in to help arrest him. During the three mile chase, all neighbors in the area could do was stay inside and watch it all unfold. People were confused about a squad car coming through a yard, or uh, I think they had an ATV out too. Um, but then when people hear the helicopter, they, uh, there are neighbors that did start saying, hey, hunker down, which is probably smart too. Mm -hmm. But uh, the police were cool, calm, collected about it. While attempting to escape, Hansen floated down river for about a mile and a half. Deputies say Hansen was throwing rocks and threatening them. He was eventually arrested just after 11 a.m. Now, there's still no word on why Hansen was on probation in the first place, but the Olmstead County Sheriff's Office does say that this investigation is ongoing and more information is expected to be released after Memorial Day weekend. Live in Orinoco, Maisie Olson, ABC 6 News.